Welcome back to the channel everyone. How are you guys all doing? I hope you guys are doing well. So guys, we got another dev blog. I was quite shocked to see this. Um, I didn't expect it. And I'm cringing all the way down into my bones. But let's get it on. And congratulations to everyone that wanted it. It's eventually yeah. But I'm actually surprised it's not in as a premium. So let's get the video playing. The Grumman F4, uh, F14B Tomcat, the Bob, Bombcat, Bombcat is here. For everyone that wanted it, there it is. I am cringing to my toes. New top tier to US naval jet fighters that come equipped with more powerful engines and new weapons. I'm cringing. The F14B Tomcat jet fighter USR high tier. Battle, uh, better thrust and climb rate. Gorgeous, uh, what? generous AM-54 Phoenix missiles. <laughs> Guided bombs. Uh, targeting identification electric opticals. If you guys want any equipment, any want to read up about the history, there you can go. Very nice looking plane. I do like the decal on the, the, the tail here. Very nice. Very nice. Um, so we'll be soon meeting the F-14B. Um, consumption, no, that's not what we really want to know. The uh, Tesno optical targeting identification system. This will allow to view targets acquired by radar on a monitor in the cockpit if the enemy aircraft is not too far. However, the main good view of an American pilot is the improved armament of the F-4B. Yes, uh, so for air combat, the main specific uh, speciality of the F-14, the new version is equipped with more advanced a AIM-9L air-to-air missiles and up to four later versions of the Sparrow missile AIM-7M AIM up to six as well as two modifications of the magnificent phoenix long-range missile aim-54a and the new aim-54c with improved integration navigation system which improves the accuracy of the cruise uh, cruising to the target at a medium and long distance both phoenix can also be taken in battle up to six missiles at once. Interesting, the F414B Tomcat is sometimes called the Bob Bob Bombcat, since it was first a uh, fighter of the series, which could be equipped with thrust, but first with conventional bomb bombs, bombs, sorry guys, bombs, and then with other types of aircraft bombs. Uh, equipped with the targeting pods, which turns to, uh, the Tomcat into a true reaper um, of the ground vehicle. Guided bombs for the paving the way to family. The GBU-12, the GBU-16, and heavy GBU-10s with laser seeking are accurate and deadly weapons to destroy any tanks on the battlefield. In addition to the guided bombs... The aircraft can also be equipped with the good old Zane rockets as well as conventional free fall bombs in calibers of up to 2,000 pounds. A nice addition will be the ability to use the already familiar BOI countermeasures pods with 160 charges each. Using the weapon configuration to set up um, your perfect set for each game mode will end and a smaller spoil alert. The aircraft will also be equipped with the new to the game type of weapons, which we'll present to you soon. Guess what, guys? Ground realistic is dead. I'm just saying. This thing, the A-10, the SU-25, ground realistic, and the helicopters. AA doesn't exist anymore in the game because you're going to have nothing to compete with it. 
um, tanks are going to be shot up like anything. So now the thing about ground realistic, in my opinion, spawn a tank in, get two or three kills, spawn aircraft, might as well just go play uh, aerial combat. That, that That's my opinion. Um, what I'm reading off of this, and if you guys understood what I said there. Um, yeah. Uh, I don't know what to say, guys. Um, I think it's just too soon. Really, I do. I think it's too soon. We needed more things in the game to, 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 to compete for. Because it's a layered thing in War Thunder. It's a layered. It's, it's, it's ground. Ground must run with aviation. Okay. And that includes helis. So you can come at the same BR. Now, at the moment, what's happening? You've got high tier tanks, not very good AA, good fighters and good ground bombers and good helicopters. There's no, there's, 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 a, there's a step missing. So what do you do when you climb the step? Either you've got to jump over to the next step or you don't see that missing step and you fall through and you land up. Yeah. Um, yeah, I just think this is, if they, there's so many nations that are still missing top tier planes to compete with these type of things. But I know what's going to happen again. It's going to be a copy and paste because the F-16 was so widely exported. They're going to copy the F-16 over to other nations just to make a stopgap me measure, um, my opinion. Um, yeah, I don't know, guys. Uh, but let me know in the comments what you guys think. I'm glad to see it in the game. It was eventually had to come. I just do believe it's a bit too soon. This is going to be killer um yeah to all the naval uh, all the aerial view, uh, players on my channel there's your f14 guys it's eventually in now let's wait for the issue 27 to come into the game all right guys so what i've got to say on the matter don't forget to hit that like comment share and subscribe keep well and i'll see you in the next one goodbye